Just shows you, you know, how hard it is to get a rise when you're that good. <laughs> <laughs> when you go in and you're on 40 quid a week and you go, oh, bet there's any chance of a fiver rise, get out that door. <laughs> uh, well, I'll tell you this much here and now, if you got 40 quid, that must have been the directors that gave you I'm, I'm, I, I, I had the most beautiful people in the world and I, I'm, mm. it's a tragedy that this character particularly has lost the game. Miller Reid. Mm -hmm. I mean to say, he was steeped in party thistle. Yeah. He loved the club and he loved the game. They and used to bring him into training. I used to train with I used to shout at him because <laughs> nobody was allowed on the party plate pearlies. <laughs> and I used to say, what are you doing? Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Manager. <laughs> Come on, you look the pitch. <laughs> but what I'm saying is, to, for the game to lose someone like that, and for particularly party thistle, who I've got tremendous fond men memories of, but that's what like it was. Yeah. It was a it was a family club and it was run and it was done with humour, but when it needed to change, we did change. Yeah. And that's in the dressing room. And I, I felt we were underachievers because we had so much quality. And here again, we had people that could hurt them in different positions, you know what I mean? Yeah. Ruffy will tell you the dress room was magnificent because we had tremendous humour and, and the they worked hard at, I had them in, in, in part time and it was Monday, Tuesdays and Thursdays and then Saturday mornings we come in and worked at all the set pieces and mm -hmm. such like. And I remember us <coughs> playing Fergie at, at, down at St Murray when, when he was in Paisley yeah. and after the game we beat them 2 nothing. And Ferry come on moaning like, no, I was the moaner, wasn't yeah. it? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and we could always turn them out, wouldn't we? The thing we used to have, we used to bring us in the Saturday morning and uh, we'd, we'd have our team, but we wouldn't be playing against anybody and we'd have the invisible ball. I'd <laughs> say. You would just go through the motion of thing and he would say, right, Ruffy, you throw that out to the full back. And I'm standing, <laughs> so I'm getting on, I'm throwing the ball out and he's going, that's the worst throw I've ever <laughs> seen in my life. <laughs> That's the worst cross. Uh, but that, Peter, that, that, that's what it is. And, and it's, <coughs> it, it's about humour. Yeah. And it's about getting people believing their self and believing their ability. And that's what they had at Partick Thistle.